Welcome back to our mini series. We're going to talk more about Thermal Imaging 101, facts that you should know as a firefighter to help you do your job more efficiently when using a thermal imaging camera. We're going to focus on a simple concept known as why wipe the lens of a thermal imaging camera. I've seen many firefighters go into a fire, they're standing up or staying low and they're wiping their face piece and complaining that they cannot see their thermal imaging camera. I've even seen them wiping the screen. What? What I haven't seen many do is wiping the lens on the front of the camera. Every thermal imaging camera has a germanium lens or metal cover on the front, which allows infrared energy to transfer through the detector. That lens gets occluded with moisture, particulate, and debris, and what happens is it degrades the image because it can't pick up infrared energy through that debris. A firefighter, every time they wipe their face piece, should wipe the lens and wipe the screen periodically. That also can be eliminated by staying low or reduced by staying low, and if the firefighter does that, it improves image clarity. However, I want to stress to you, as good as the image looks when you're playing around in training or checking it out in the day room, when you're in that zero visibility environment, you may have to wipe that lens a lot. If you're searching above the fire, if you have high moisture content, you may have to wipe it a lot. The other thing is firefighters have mistakenly used these devices in cold smoke or high moisture environments such as a sprinkler head activation in a warehouse. Moisture is kryptonite to a fire, a fire service tick. If it gets on the lens, it will block it out, as I said. But if you've got constant moisture coming down, how effective will any device be? Make sure you understand the context of your environment, where you're working, why you like the lens, and why you use this device in such a way that helps you see better. But my challenge to you is don't over-rely on it. It's a secondary means of orientation. It can help you or it can hinder you. I've seen many people, just like me, over-rely on my cell phone only to find out when I needed it most, it failed me. I want you to stay fundamentally sound and use this device to enhance what you do, not replace what you do. Keep up the good work, stay intelligently aggressive, and check out thermal.com and our website for more resources, specifically ours on preventing firefighter disorientation and why wipe the lens, and let us know if you have any questions. Thanks.